Another Fast Track Video Update, PRI 2013. And if you remember this gentleman at the East Bay Winter Nationals, the 37th annual East Bay Winter Nationals, but man, he dominated. Hit the likes of Rambo, Dennis Franklin, David Smith, Ferguson, and uh, any many other hot shoes uh, that, that run up at, uh, at East Bay. And of course, also on the Fast Track Circuit. Driver the number 58, Barry Wright out of Middleburg, Florida. They call him the Magic Man, Mark Whitener. Mark, welcome to PRI, man. Thanks for stopping by the Fast Track booth. And how's the season been since uh, going three for three at East Bay, which, by the way, is a new record. Nobody has ever gone three for three in all of the Crate Late Model events for the Winter Nationals at East Bay Raceway Park. Thank you. It's good good having me here. Uh, yeah, we, we feel pretty good. Last year we, we took all three races against that stiff competition there, so uh, we feel pretty good. Uh, we're going to hit it this year and see if we can do it again. That's it. Got to do it to it. And, of course, uh, he had a great, great racing season. We're talking to Mark Whitener, of course, on this Fast Track video update of Middleburg, Florida. Man, what was it that your first time running with Fast Track was, was at East Bay? To come out of the gate and be competitive and win the way you did, what did it take, seriously? Uh, we just pre prepared. Um, our car was good. Um, we were from Florida, so we, we got a, a key on the track. And um, just, just I mean, just working hard on our cars, a team effort. And um, just, I mean, Good guys to race with, keeping the nose clean, and uh, I mean that's that's what it takes. Just, just. Hard. Okay, so now the question is, of course, uh, the East Bay Winter Nationals, the 38th annual consecutive East Bay Winter Nationals at Al Varnador and, and uh, you know, Todd Hutto and all the great folks at uh, the Clay by the Bay East Bay Raceway Park. If you never have been to East Bay, you need to come out there. The atmosphere is electric. It's exciting. It's eccentric. You will enjoy it. And uh, it's a month of racing. Fast Track is going to be part of it the second week before the Lucas Oil Label on the Dirt Series come in for their big event for a week of racing at East Bay. And, uh, and we're going to see you in the Fast Track car again, and uh, you're going to run the Lucas Oil also, right? Yes, sir. We're going to run Lucas Oil. We're going to run Fast Track. And uh, just we're going to do all the racing we can to make some money in, uh, in Florida Speed Weeks this year. There you go. How do you adapt from running a crate late model or a Fast Track Pro late model then jumping in one of the full-fledged supers, kind of like an ultimate super late model? Yeah, it's... Uh, I don't, it's not really a big difference. I mean, you race with a bunch of guy, good guys in each one of them, so just a little faster. Uh, decisions are a little, a little quicker to be made, but uh, other than that, it's it's no big deal. Awesome, good deal. Well, Mark, man, before we let you go, this is your great chance to thank out your sponsors and your friends and your family and everybody that helps you out here. And I appreciate you stopping by the Fast Track booth at BRI. Yeah, thank you. Uh, I'd like to thank uh, Craig and Augie. They they own the car, and then Mike Ray, crew chief, he works on it, and of course my wife and the kids and my whole family that supports man this is a team effort that, uh, that we've done all year we won a united dirt label championship and uh, took a team to do it so i didn't just do it they took our team and, and of course my wife she followed me around all the races so uh, uh yeah i'd like to thank everybody thank everybody that made this happen hey can you turn around real quick turn around everybody of course get ready for 2014 and a little touch of the magic man Mark Whitener, right here on this Fast Track video update from PRI 2013. I'm Wesley Outley at FastTrackRacing.com, Fast Track underscore Racing on Twitter and Facebook. And Mark Whitener, ready to go for 2014.